Hi, I'm going to show you how to add a featured photo for a product. So after logging into the WordPress website, uh, you will start here on the dashboard. You scroll down to products and go to all products. I have already gone there and then I select, I will just show you how we are doing it to make sure it's very clear. So we go to all products and here we see this product does not have a featured photo so that's why it doesn't show the photo here and all the products should have a featured photo so that they appear as thumbnails in the rest of the website so we scroll down uh, if we need to make any changes to the description we can make it here I have added this button I mean this is a link actually and people can go there to leave a message so here we see that the product image does not have anything set. So I'm going to uh, click set product image. And I think this is the old version that we already had but that was too big. So I'm going to click on upload files. And here I can just drag the photo that I have downloaded to my computer. So if you go to the tiny PNG and optimize the photo, you download it and then you can just drag it here. And here we can see the size is just 230 kilobytes, which is great. So we always want to get in the habit of adding an alternative text, which means a description. This is used by uh, screen readers for people that have problems with their vision and it's not visible otherwise on the website, but it helps with the, showing the website in search results. Uh, because the robots behind the scenes can recognize this tag. So here we'll just say white wrap. Again, this is not a photo caption, so it's not going to appear visible. And here for the title, it would be great to use descriptive titles, so not like a image number, but say white wrap. This also helps with the SEO. Okay. So now, and the photo title will not appear on the website. It just helps from a technical perspective. So we click set product image. So now the product has appeared. We need to make sure that we click update. It takes a little time. And then afterwards, we can click here on view product in another tab. So I'm going to open that other tab. It is loading and now we can see that this is the product that we have here. It has great clarity despite the fact that we optimized it. So that's why we want to use that. Another photo, the product looks great. So if we go to shop and we go to wraps, now we are seeing this wrap. Actually, we just have one wrap, I believe, because um, it's just available in different colors. So that's uh, the end of this tutorial. I hope it was clear. Uh, otherwise, please let me know and I'll make sure to uh, clarify further. Thanks for watching.